Imagine Ready? finding you this. See it? Oh my goodness. Oh. I'm looking out for alligators. That is a beautiful arrowhead. I just encountered our first snake. Wow! Oh. Dude, this is crazy. Good morning or good afternoon, everyone. Welcome if you're new here. My name is Polly. Today, we got permission to hunt for one of my favorite things to find, and that's ancient artifacts. I'm in Florida on private property, so everything that I find, I can keep. However, I probably will just give it back to the property owner. Oh my god, a lot! My goal today is to find one arrowhead and my first shark tooth. Hopefully a big one. Are we in the jungle? I'm gonna find something so special. Up your chances, throw a whole bunch in there. Come on, Robbie. My hands are wet. All right, here we go. Moment of truth, here goes Polly. Let's see if he finds his first fossil. Come on, Polly, let's do it. Okay, um, right, we won't show the world this. Do it again. <laughs> 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 All right, so this is Polly's first time looking for a fossil. <laughs> I'm so excited for my very first one. Let's right, go right here. We hopefully don't find glass the hard way. Yep. I know. Oh, uh, I see. You feel how it feels totally different? Yes. <laughs> All right, moment of truth. Here we go. The one right there, I feel it. Is it a shell or something? Fin? That's a piece of an eagle ray mouth plate. Wow. See, how do you yeah. know that? <laughs> <laughs> I found a lot of them. So it's male or female? <laughs> <laughs> We're here with Paleo Chris. He is a professional at doing all this, so we don't really understand what we're finding, but we'll just ask him all the questions. <laughs> <laughs> so I did two full sifters, and I didn't find anything. So Jake's doing his second one, and he's probably gonna find something. Jake, you're gonna find an iPhone. <laughs> Let's see what I missed. Oh, look. Oh my goodness, Got a dude. shark tooth right off the bat. That was just right there for you, Paul. What happened, man? <laughs> oh, got another shark to you. Hold on, let's keep going. Oh, I got a big one. I quit. <laughs> I'm going home. Where's the airport? I'm just giving Paul a hard time. But this is not the best spot. Let's head to the better spot and hopefully find some amazing stuff. Right here. Is this it? Is this the one? Yeah, this will be it. Come on, Paul. It's your first two. Oh, oh, that's a good one. There you go. You oh. found it. <laughs> what is that? That's Chris? a tiger shark tooth. A tiger shark tooth. Is there's there's one. No. Oh, there is one. Yeah, there you go. You got one. <laughs> My very first shark tooth. Oh, pity. So I looked for another 12 hours and I found three other small shark teeth and then a piece of a piece of a mammoth tooth. Holy cow. Pretty small. Let's see if we can find something bigger. I just encountered our first snake. You see? I almost sat on that bank right there. I totally would have been bit. So even though I was just about to dig here, I'm not gonna bug that snake. We're gonna go find a new spot. So I've moved downstream from upstream. Are we upstream or downstream? So I moved upstream from the snake and found another spot here. A ton of heavy gravels, heavy materials. I'm gonna assume there's gonna be something heavy here. Hopefully a bone, shark tooth, maybe an arrowhead. Oh, you passed one. Oh, wow. There you go. That's a beauty. Little lemon shark tooth. Lemon? Lemon. Do they taste like lemon? Yeah. That's actually a beautiful one. <laughs> nice. So my very first scoop I put down, I found a shark tooth right there. Second scoop, another shark tooth right there. And the third and fourth, nothing. But there's gonna be a few in here, I'm pretty certain. This place is loaded in shark teeth. That's what we're searching for. One scoop. <laughs> <laughs> Every sound is freaking me out. <laughs> so I just found my first megalodon tooth. It's broken and it's actually a baby. Look how big that is. That's a baby. They get bigger. <laughs> so you guys might be wondering why on earth there are small shark teeth in this tiny little creek in the middle of Florida. The reason is that the entire area was an ocean at one time. There were sharks swimming around us. And later, as the water levels went down, this became a river. And there were Native Americans living on the side of this river. Now it's just a tiny little trickle of a creek, and uh, we're finding all the stuff that was lost here. The last time Chris was here, this is what he pulled out of the river. Imagine finding this just sitting on top of your sifter. I would scream like a little chicken. That would be really cool, man. I've been doing a lot of walking around, and I'm really trying to find something and then surprise people with it. So I've just changed spots again, looking for 
a big shark tooth, hopefully Megalodon, and an arrowhead. This spot looks really good as it's really narrow. I think right here there would have been a camp or a settlement from the First Nations, so I'm gonna try right here. I thought that was a tooth. It's just a rock. Oh, there's a shark tooth right there. It's a nice one. That's a lemon shark? That is a tiger shark right there. Nice. Put it in mouth. Mmm, <laughs> it's a lemon shark on that one. Sweet. So we lost Bree for a little while. And we hear her screaming. She came back and she's about to show me what she found. <laughs> so far, this is my best find. Whole <laughs> <laughs> Half of wow. a large megalodon tooth. Oh my god. <laughs> Can you guess what's in here? Holy <laughs> cow. That is huge. I thought it was a rock when I grabbed it in the water. I was pulling rocks out and it was this. Oh <laughs> <laughs> That's High five. Ooh. <laughs> I just found a fossilized clamshell. It's completely translucent, and this proves that this used to be the ocean floor. That's pretty freaking cool. <laughs> There's something about pulling dirt out of the center of a creek in the middle of nowhere that's surprisingly satisfying. Be able to find ancient tools. Look at that. That's called a flake. When the First Nations people would make a tool out of stone, they would chip away at the rock, and these are the chips or the flakes. I found a piece of my biggest megalodon tooth right here and then a uh, fossilized shell. I like it. It's translucent and pointy. I'm bound to find an arrowhead near. I wanna be the first one to do it. <laughs> so working here right next to Polly, I finally pulled out my first point of the day. What? Right here? Yeah, right here. It turns out that there were two in my screen what? instead of one. Both oh. of them are missing the tip, but you know, that's still an amazing find. I'm happy with that for the day. <laughs> <laughs> so Bree just found her two arrowheads right here, and I'm working right here. There's gotta be one right here, come on. Another little shark tooth. So I just moved down a little bit. My first little scoop, I just found a broken arrowhead. It's missing the tip and a little bit of the bottom. Still really cool and it has a little cool marketing in it too. Now let's see if we can find a whole one. I'm not gonna lie, this is sort of sketchy. There's alligators around here. So it's been around six, seven hours of us just walking up and down this creek. All of us have found shark teeth and arrowheads. Jake I think has the best one of the day. Check this out. Oh no way. That is a beautiful arrowhead. Wow. If you put a price on this, it's uh, $1.2 million. Or at least Chris is willing to pay that. Yeah, so. a bit, bit less because you found it, right? No, a bit more. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go further down to where we started to see if I can find a big megalodon tooth. There is still some time left, so I'm not giving up yet. I don't quite know where I'm at, but uh, I'm confident I'm going in the right direction. I'm looking out for alligators. <laughs> I've seen snakes so far. It's almost at the end of the day. I'm actually way behind everybody else's back down After straight. you. I'm gonna switch to the bigger classifier, see if we can find anything as a last ditch effort. With all the sand that I What makes this stuff. trip special for me is that looking for arrowheads is what started my YouTube channel in the first place. And if you scroll down far enough, you'll see exactly what I mean. <gasps> uh. something? I think so. So Bree just yelled at me right as I was doing my outro. Let's see what she's screaming about. You ready? You see it? Oh my goodness. Wow. Wow. <laughs> that is amazing. Good find. So Bree is the only person out of all of us who's been non-stop digging, and this is why. <laughs> she found half a huge mag and now a beautiful arrowhead. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> that was right here? Yeah, in this hole. Jeez. <laughs> it's like... Translucent. Yeah, it's translucent too. Oh, I didn't know that was gonna happen to me. <laughs> <laughs> and that's it. 
So unfortunately, it's getting dark now and I won't be able to continue much longer. So I'm gonna end this video right now. I'll show you a quick video of all the little shark teeth I found along with some of the fossils and that broken arrowhead I found. If you enjoyed this video, chances are you're going to enjoy what I've previously posted and what's coming in the future. So please don't hesitate to hit that subscribe button or follow me on my Instagram, TikTok, or Facebook if you wanna see anything else extra. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for your support. And until next one, black screen with logo.